Totem Trouser. Hi, everybody. My name's Totem Trouser. Uh, welcome back to this. I have a lot of money. I could buy a person if I really wanted to. Uh, can't use them in this, so it's like, whatever. That's Kane Kicks Ass. Uh, this isn't one of those games where, like, you can add the, the legends in afterwards. Uh, I think when I do Here Comes the Pain, I might just, like, run through and unlock everybody really quick, just so I can throw them in there, because that's more fun when you're like, oh, hey, look, I'm going against Andre. That's how we just start SmackDown now. Twenty-minute promos. By now, a certain WWE I mean, yeah. <laughs> superstar dared to interfere in the match I made last week. Interfere? The match was over. He came down to help his friend. So I think it's time that perpetrator learned a thing or two about respecting authority, and that's why. Yo! <laughs> I unironically marked for Kurt Angle. I'm invested in the storyline. Yeah. You suck. You suck. Hi, Vince. Remember me? I used to be general manager of this show until you brushed me aside. I legitimately forgot moment. that. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I'm back because the WWE members of the board aren't too pleased with the way you've been abusing the talent and disrespecting the terms of the brand extension. Those are bad business moves, Vince. What the fuck is he doing? Is he doing Capoeira while he cuts this promo? So I've been empowered to return as general manager and strip you of all administrative powers until after WrestleMania. Because you're going to be a participant. Wouldn't he just fire you after Mania? You can't do this to me. I'm Vince McMahon, damn it. Oh, I can. And I just did. And as for your stooges in the ring there with you, why don't you both take some time off and come back after WrestleMania? <laughs> in fact, that's not a request. <laughs> Oh my god, they just took fucking, they just took, they just took John Cena and Shawn Michaels out of Wrestlemania so Scotty Too Hotty could have a storyline. <laughs> oh, it's the best. It's so Vince, silly. We do agree on one thing. That perpetrator, as you call him, should see some action tonight for his interference in last week's match. In fact, he should face the man whose plans he interrupted. So I'm giving him a match against you, Vince. A handicap match. And he'll team up with the man you'll be facing in your Hell in a Cell match this Sunday at WrestleMania. This feels like the build-up to uh, WrestleMania 15, where every week was a special referee match. Um, but instead of special referee, it's handicap matches. I don't think Mr. McMahon's going to get out of this one. Well, also, that sucked, one, by the way. General Manager Kurt Angle just put Mr. McMahon in his place. Angle. Okay, who's main eventing over Mr. McMahon? Um, Taker, Mysterio, and Rico versus Booker T, Eddie Guerrero, and Dupree. Okay, I mean, that's not like... Yeah, okay. I could see... The, there are four people I, in that six-man tag I could see being main eventers. Turn it up. Bojo, bojo. I don't think they ever changed McMahon's Titantron. Like, I'm trying to remember, like, what does McMahon's Titantron look like? And I straight up think it is that. Like, it is just... Like, I mean, now they do logos instead of Trons. So it's not that. Unless you look up at, like, the, the screen in the middle. The scoreboard screen. But, uh, giggity. Uh, but yeah, like, I think they always just kept that Vince McMahon Titantron until they got rid of him. I mean, it's a good ass Titantron, so, like, whatever. I'm gonna inject WWE with poison right into his butt. I'm injecting the poison into his butt with a senton and a kick to the face. I'm gonna squash the shit out of you, McMahon. 
Oh, dude, I'm throwing McMahon off the cell. I don't even care. I don't even know how I how to do that, but I'm doing it. <laughs> I wonder if it's one of those games where I can just throw him off the cell anywhere, because those are the best. The ones where you can just chuck him off the cell, like, onto the ground instead of a table. <laughs> Which never happened, because it would kill the person who took the bump. Like... I kick his ass. <laughs> It's a wanted to curse. It's a wanted to live this life. Aw. Uh, yeah! Weird overdrive hurricane rata. Why are there so Is that why we're friends? Because we know how to turn the overdrive into a more interesting move? Is that... <laughs> Oh god! Oh, I got him! Ha! Heel to the back of the head, bitch! Rolling thunder bomb! Oh my god, Rob Van Dam's moveset so fucking extra in this game. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh god, oh right. Five star frog splash, that was a stupid question. That I didn't ask, technically. Yo! That was cool! <laughs> now, is this a good frog splash? Yes, because he bounces over him! Okay, yes! The fucking bounce that Rob Van Dam has on the frog splash is the best. Like, it just, it's my favorite top rope move because when he hits it, he goes flying because of the, like, it just makes it seem like the impact's that much more. Play the game! Mr. McMahon is going to be in the fight of his life this Sunday at Oh shit! This is the end of the game! <laughs> We're not gonna get 20 minutes out of this episode. Fuck! I might maybe merge this with the other episode? Who knows? <laughs> If this is only one episode, a really long episode, that's what I did. So, in the meantime, I'll probably talk. Maybe. Uh, just a oh, funny way to talk. Okay, so here we are. At 52 overall. <laughs> It would suck if I lost this. <laughs> Oh yeah, fuck yeah, we get the promo package. Never happened. One last time. Never happened. Technically that did happen, but he wasn't wearing that close. That never happened. That probably happened. Yeah, I can see that happening. I did fight him. That never happened, but it's gonna. <laughs> that never happened. That happened a lot, actually, in the build up to this um, storyline, yeah. This is the theme song to WrestleMania 20, in which the main, oh god, the main event of 20 is different. Oh, 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 that's probably good for WWE that the main event of WrestleMania 20 is not what it ended up being. Wait, shit. Was 20, 20 was the Ben, yeah, yeah, 20 is the Ben Wah year. Yeah, okay. And one of the biggest matches by far is the Hell in a Cell match that Mr. McMahon got himself into. Against his will, I might add. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. It could have been Mr. Oh my god, am I in the main event of Mania? <laughs> I mean, come on, it wouldn't be the first time he got his hands dirty in the ring. In any case, by the time it's over, someone's gonna have to pay the pipe. McMahon's technically never been in the main event of Mania. Like, he was in the... He was involved in the match at... At, uh, 16. Well, you did it. 
You got yourself a fair fight against Vince McMahon at WrestleMania. But that's half the battle. I feel like only one of you... You're right, because I'm going to throw that one. senior off the cell at least twice. <laughs> yeah, but don't worry. It's nice that Vince McMahon finally pays for all of his sins. <laughs> that's the night I sent him to hell. Literally, because I'm going to throw him off of that fucking ramp. <laughs> fucking cell. I'm back in one piece, okay? I'm about to fuck Trish Stratus again, aren't I? Thanks, Trish. Well, I guess this is it. Oh, look at that! We're just friends! We're just friends! Men and women can be friends! Thank you! Thank you! Finally! It's showing that you can just be friends with a woman without having sex with her! Good on you, WWE! It only took you four tries to fucking show that! Mr. McMahon, in just a few minutes, you've got a huge Hell in a Cell match against an opponent who has sworn to get even with you after the beating you gave him last month. Yeah, you did kick my ass. Get even with me? Even with me? I'm the chairman of a billion dollar company. I built this business into what it is today. I made WrestleMania, the granddaddy of them all. I made it into what it is today. I'm even a former WWE champion, damn it. Get even? Oh no. He's got no chance in hell of getting even with Vince McMahon. And I promise, no, 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 I guarantee that tonight I'm going to give that insubordinate punk the beating of his life in that very ring, my very ring. And once it's over, nobody will ever say no to Vincent Kennedy McMahon. No one ever says no to you anyway. Okay, okay, so, wait, hold up, time out. First up, multiple things. <laughs> First off, <laughs> Hell in the Cell is opening with Mania. Whatever, I can see that in modern day uh, WWE. That is something that I could see happening. Uh, second, uh, Booker T versus Triple H did happen. That's a that's a match that happened next year or two. I don't know if that's twenty one or twenty two that that happens, but that happens. So we'll let that one slide. Uh, I think it's twenty two because twenty one is Batista. Right? I think so. That sounds right. So. Um, so whatever, we'll let that slide. Now, this triple threat. <laughs> now, once again, the, the main event of Mania was a triple threat that featured Chris Benoit and Shawn Michaels and Triple H. So, um, I like how I made a joke about how, like, oh, great, we could just pretend Chris Benoit never won the main event of Mania. <laughs> and then they make a match in which the only person who's still in the match is the man who kills his family. So, um... Not great. Also, hey, yo, good on Shelton for main eventing Mania. Um, so that's rad. I hope he wins. That'd be cool. I certainly hope Benoit doesn't. Okay, uh, exits, enters the chamber door, climbs the cell. Before... Yeah, no, we're not doing this in here, buddy. Come on. <laughs> you know where we're going. Oh my god, look how easy that is. I don't even need to, like, build up a finisher or any stupid shit. Bah! <laughs> Bitch. Dick. You, you would not kill... I can't imagine anyone, like, willingly, like, Yeah, man, Hell in the Cell. Like, even... Like, they sell the fact that, like, Hell in the Cell is, like, this, like, demonic structure that, like, you're gonna fucking ruin careers on it and shit. But the thing is, is, like, modern-day Hell in the Cell matches, I mean, they're pretty brutal. Like, I didn't watch all of the Sasha Banks, uh, Becky one that fucking just happened, but, like, I saw some shit, uh, and I was like, I can't imagine ever thinking, yeah, no, that's the moves I want to take. I think we all have become Mankind, like, seven. And by that, I mean Mankind times seven. Yeah, bitch! Yeah! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> this is awesome! 
Oh god, he's up first. Oh god, he's up first. Aha! <laughs> I've countered you. Well, the match between Scotty Too Hotty basically just evolved into Scotty Too Hotty throwing Mr. McMahon off the cell or through the cell uh, multiple times. So uh, we're going to give it 17 stars. No, oh, get up again. Oh, you bitch. Hey, perfect, perfect. That's actually what I wanted you to do. Thank you. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's going to put me through the cell. <laughs> Ha, I'm not on the cell anymore, bitch. You know exactly what's about to happen to you. <laughs> no, 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 no. Come on. Get up. Oh, McMahon, you bitch. Take the spot, McMahon. Damn it. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I thought I was about to get kicked over. Man, how much can they keep Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going bad for me. Let's just hit some finishers on him real quick. Let's actually do some work before we fucking die here. What the fuck? Yep. There we go. Okay. That's your finisher? You just punched me a couple times? The fuck was that? Okay. Yeah, you need to go, like, you need to get your ass whipped, dude, because you're beating the shit out of me right now, and that's, like, not okay. <laughs> Just get to a safe point and start taunting, baby. It's got it too hot. dancing on top of hell in the cell. <laughs> Woo. I'm putting you through this cell, McMahon. I, I just hope you know that. That's the spot. Oh, fuck. Bitch. <laughs> Okay. But now I think I'm back to winning, which is nice. Ah, oh, damn it, that wasn't close enough, really? Come on, game. Like, get up. No, up, 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 up. God damn, with the fucking. Ah, fuck my life. Ah, fuck! <laughs> Jump, do it, jump, 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 coward, jump, coward. Oh, fuck. What a match. Bitch. <sighs> fuck. <laughs> Okay, thank you for going the long way, I guess. Fuck you, McMahon! Bleed! <laughs> God damn it. Okay, I think it's time for us to end this match the only way we know how.
Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. There. Don't you dare. One, two, three. Ah! Each of these superstars. Well, we lost. <laughs> I'm not sure what more damage these two can possibly do to each other. I don't like the looks of this at all. He's he's climbing back back to the top of the cell. No, he can't be thinking. Do it, do it. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, I can't. I don't know if anybody can survive that kind of impact. Wow. I gotta hand it to Mr. McMahon, putting his body on the line, but he might not ever be the same. I don't know if either of them will. What a way to end this rivalry. That had to be the most brutal match in the history of WrestleMania. Action, yeah, I mean, we both went off the cell like 30 times, so yeah. Oh well, it happens. That was it! That was the end of the game. Um... So... Did not end the way I wanted it to. Did not go the way I wanted it to. This entire Let's Play will probably get redone at some point. Um, when I am in a better headspace for the beginning. Um, and maybe am in a better position to, to beat the game. Um, in a way that actually has me beating the game. Um... At the end of the day, though, so I came to this realization uh, a couple of days ago when I was thinking about this. I'm like, I might not actually get to win the WWE title like I thought I would. What it ends up being is now I can replay this game um, as, like, I've shown you every single title line that you get when you don't. Because this game has multiple branching title or multiple branching paths. Right, every month I believe there are three options uh, for your storyline. There is, uh, you can be uh, just a normal guy, no title, uh, a champion, or going after a championship. So I can do a a run where I am just the champion every month. Uh, like I'll just pick like Triple H or something and just do that. Um, and we can see that. You know what I mean? It will be easier to see to do it that way and we'll see the whole thing so at the end of the day i like i said i'm gonna redo this probably um because very disappointing ending i'm kind of bummed that i lost to mcmahon there this um not to call john's but i'm using a very here one sec i i i'd be able to Okay, I might not be able to show you if I did that. But um, I'm using a very bad controller here, and uh, it straight up, I've, I've tried mashing it out. It doesn't work. Um, I, I cannot figure out why. It just doesn't, it, I, I can't mash with this thing. Like, I'll fucking slam the buttons and it won't work. I, uh, I plan on buying another one. Um, like an actual official one. That's what I had for the longest time was an official controller. And it, um... Oh, God, I hope I didn't pick up audio. No, okay, cool. Um, I, I had, like, an official controller, and then when I moved, it stopped working. Uh, so I had to borrow one from my old roommate who, who like, he gave it to me, which is great, but it's, like, a shitty plastic hunk of GameStop shit. Uh, and that's not me calling John. Like, I lost a lot of those matches because I was mainly just kind of having a good time, right? I, I wasn't, like, you if you guys have seen me play this game seriously a couple times where, like, uh, I I was in that ag match or that handicap match a couple episodes ago where I barely talked and I was just super sweaty and it lasted, like, 30 minutes. That's not as fun. I, me picking Scotty Too Hotty was more so meant to just be kind of a, a joke. Like this was a joke let's play the entire time and never meant it was never more than that. Um Oh hey, cool. Here what I can show you this controller. Check this out, ready? Hey, it's me, hi. Look at that. Look at this piece of garbage. Look at this. It this is 
like if I could describe how poorly this, I'm gonna take my ugly ass face off. I didn't do my hair or anything. This is my day off. I just woke up, rolled out of bed, made myself some coffee, and yeah. Um, okay, face going away now. Bye. Um, but like this thing is rough. <laughs> um, at the end of the but yeah, no, this was more as like a fun, just whatever. Uh, this game kicks ass, uh, straight up. Like this is. The first wrestling game I ever actually owned, not counting WWF Attitude, which, like, I don't. I have been on Dreamcast. Maybe one of these days, if I can fucking figure out how to um, get decent quality on an Elgato from a, uh, an analog console, I will fucking show you guys that game. It is bad. Um, I would do it in, like, a, a live stream, though. I'm not going to do it in real life, uh, like, as a Let's Play. I don't even know if it has a story mode. It might. Maybe we'll... I don't know, man. Um, either way, if I do it as, like, an actual Let's Play, I'm gonna do it like I did this, where I'm just gonna emulate it, because, like, this looks so much better than what it used to look like. Uh, so, th what, am I, what are we gonna do next? Um, there's a couple things I wanna do. Uh, so, I think I've talked about this. I don't know if I talked about this in Totem Talks. Um, I actually have, for the first time in a really long time, uh, a list of games I wanna take down. Um, I know the first one, um... I, I played through Arkham City a couple days ago, and I was like, you know what? I want to play Arkham Asylum. Or, no, I'm sorry. Uh, Arkham Knight. I played through Arkham Knight, and I was like, I want to... I, I never gave Arkham City a good shot. I just kind of rushed through it, because there wasn't the kind of side quests there were um, in that game in Arkham Asylum. So, what I think I'm... I know eventually I'm going to do Arkham Asylum. Uh, um, and then we're going to just start like that, right? Uh, I have Bioshock 2. I could always do. Um... I I have Legacy of Goku one. Um, I like I'm just I'm going because I like to be the kind of, I like to complete series. And one of my biggest pet peeves on Let's Plays, or not even a pet peeve, uh, it's the opposite. One of the things that actually makes me like a Let's Play channel more is when I go to your channel and you have um, the entire game, like series of a game. Um, so like. I never played an Earthbound game, but I know everything that happens in them because I watched all the Chuck Conroy's shit, right? Um, so we might do Legacy of Goku 1. Uh, I'm, I'm honestly actually really thinking about doing that one next. It uh, It's just one of those things. If I need to find a ROM now, because <laughs> uh, the, the site where I got my ROMs uh, got scared when they were like, hey, uh, oh, Kevin Dunn, boo! Um, so... Uh, I, they got really scared when Nintendo started suing people, so they took all their ROMs off, so I need to fucking find another ROM site, and, like, that's actually really hard nowadays, because Nintendo scared a lot of people, um, so, uh, I need to find that, and it, like, I, I own the game, so it's, I'm, I'm not, like, breaking a law, um, but, just like with this game, like, I own this game, you fucking half the Let's Play was in the game I owned, um, but, yeah, so I need to find that, uh, I can always, I, I'm, I'm, I, this channel will see me playing all of Castlevania, uh, every game, uh, which is, I mean, it's not gonna be, it's gonna take a while, but I'm gonna do it. Um, I really want to play Vampire, but if I'm playing Vampire, I want to do a no-kill run, which is how I actually originally played it, um, and I want to, I want to actually get a kill everything run in out of it, so I might, like, in between, and I just haven't really been able to get into that game again, um, Part of me wants to try Valkyria Chronicles on this channel. I tried playing through it myself um, recently, and I kind of bounced off of it a little bit. But like, it's one of those games that like I play, and I'm like, man, man, I really like this game. And then after a while, it just kind of bounced off of it. So I'm scared of starting it on this because the thing about this is like, if I start a game on this channel, I feel can like I feel like I have to finish it, right? Like I, it took me a really hard, like it took it was very hard for me to go like, you know what? I don't want to finish Shining Force. Um, fuck, dude, I might go back and finish Shining Force eventually. I just really don't want to. <laughs> it, uh, like, I was just thinking about that game, and it's just so much of it. It's just, it just got so difficult out of nowhere. Bust a nut in your eye music. <laughs> oh, look, there it is again. Bust a nut in your eye music. What the fuck? Is that a real, is that a real label? Oh, wait, we're Googling this now. Um, but yeah, so I, um, I don't know, like, part, like, I really do think that RPGs are, um, uh, RPGs are really a good game, 
type for Let's Plays, I just never really played them. Um, other than, like, Pokemon and shit. So, like, I, I don't have the affinity for them or, like, the long-termness of them. So, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Um... I just got a, a tribe called uh, Quest. Um, bong. Okay. So that's it, I guess. Um, I don't know what we're going to be doing next. Because I, it's also Halloween time. Um, which is one of the reasons why I, all these came out in one day. And I like rushed them out. It's like I want to get these out so I can do something scary maybe. Um, so maybe we'll do Bioshock. I don't really know. I'm going to... Part of me wants to do Legacy of Goku because I know it'll be really quick. And, and if I'm being an asshole. Um, straight up, like I... Um, so if like all the Dragon Ball Z series gets me a shit ton of views, um, and I don't know why, but I am thinking about finishing up Legacy of Goku, uh, just because also too, they're releasing Legacy of Goku again, technically, but they're doing it as a, uh, I think it's called like Dragon Ball Z Goku or Kakarot or something like that. Like it's a new series, but it's basically Legacy of Goku. So I kind of want to do that. So we'll probably see that coming if I can find a ROM for it. If not, maybe we'll just do like Castlevania and go one of those really quick. We'll see. My name's Totem Trouser though. Um, before we finish, I just wanted to show you this. So we are going to do this, um, if I remember. So we can carry over titles and superstar points. So if I hit yes, right? Look at that. I'm Sky Too Hottie. And I can compete for this title if I wanted to. So, the, the Scotty Too Hottie saga is not over, ladies and gentlemen. But he will take a break and will return. And he will win the WWE Championship. That I promise you. My name's Totem Trouser. You guys stay beautiful. Goodbye. <laughs>